All right, check it out. Um, the name of this sandwich confuses me. It's the hot honey bacon sandwich, but there's cheese and egg and bacon and Mike's Hot Honey, a little collaboration with uh, Duncan. But why is the sandwich called the hot honey bacon sandwich? That would mean just bacon and hot honey on a brioche bun. That's the other thing. Uh, I think first time ever Duncan using a, uh, using, using a uh, brioche bun. But why isn't it called the bacon, egg, and cheese hot honey sandwich? Something like that. I don't know. I digress. I wasn't in the boardroom when they came up with the name. It's in this bag right here. We're going to check it out. Cue the intro. What is up, everyone? It is the endorsement, and it is time for another review. This is where I try something and tell you if you should like it or not. I can be very persuasive, hot honey bacon sandwich. You tell me what you think that is. Serviettes. All right, so let's reach in, grab this, take this bag, and let that a little hit the console, let a little fall. I should do a little, I should have my other phone over here filming the escapades of the bag whenever I do the bag throw. But here's another bag. I'm not gonna be throwing that, but it does have a bunch of uh, maybe Mike's Hot Honey kind of on it right now. All right, ooh, that's a soft bun. So yeah, brioche bun, check it out right there. Got the brioche bun, hot honey bacon. Is that what they're calling it? Is that why it's called the hot honey bacon sandwich? It's hot honey bacon, egg and melted white cheddar cheese on a buttery brioche bun, again drizzled with Mike's hot honey. So I guess the uh, bacon they're calling it hot honey bacon. So I guess that explains the name. Hot honey bacon instead of just regular bacon. You know, I'm gonna have to try a, uh, a bite of this. Let's go. This guy pulled in, he's like, what's this guy doing? Just, all right, let's try the bacon. Oh yeah. Yeah, little sweetness, very little spice. I don't see much. Oh yeah, there's a little extra spice right there. And uh, here's the top. I should have got some extra uh, Mike's Hot Honey because you know, a lot of times these places, it is what it is. You can even look at it right there. I don't even see much. Uh... I mean, I tasted it, but man, that's so limited. Wow. All right. It is what it is. You know my feelings. If you watch the channel enough uh, about uh, food over at Dunkin', Usually, usually not very impressed. I will say this is a very soft brioche bun. So they are getting uh, props for that. And there's the standard like fast food egg, again, the bacon. And there is that uh, melted white cheddar cheese. All right, wish me luck. I'm gonna go right into this little thick part, T-H-I-C, wish me luck. Take a look. All right. It definitely 100% needs more Mike's Hot Honey. You're having something called the Hot Honey Bacon Sandwich and it's supposed to drizzle. How do I not see it? So all I'm really getting is that little bit of sweetness and that little bit of spice, and I'm talking a little bit of spice from this, I don't know, one, one and a half uh, slices of bacon kind of ripped up right there. $5.69. The bun is nice. It might be a little too much bun for what you're getting on the inside. Kind of look at the cross section right there. So it's a hefty uh, bun and it's so soft, has a really nice flavor. I'm a fan of uh, brioche most times, but with the amount of stuff you got going in there, I think it is uh, too much bread and not enough um, hot honey. It's a very simple breakdown. Oh yeah, that's a Java suck. Again, not sponsored. I shout them out every video where I have a Dunkin' drink 
or a uh, fast food uh, large where it fits right into that Java sock and keeps it cold. But anyway, um, overpriced, I think if you would deliver more on the inside to compensate for all of that bread, I think we're talking it would get close to being worth $5.69. This is a $4.59 uh, sandwich if I've ever seen one, but I'm not going to gloss over anymore. It is a really nice bun. It, I'm loving the bun. The flavor's okay. I just need more hot honey and I need more on the inside. Very simple. Mm. The hot honey's almost non-existent. Yeah. One more look. You see? Mm. All right, so that's a very simple breakdown. The flavoring on the inside with the egg and the uh, white cheddar, it's kind of basic. It is what it is. The bun gets a 95. This bun is really good, but everything else uh, just misses the mark for me. Not impressed. If it had more of what I talked about, then I might be a little more impressed. It might be a serviceable um, sandwich, but for what I got today, no. One to 100. The bun is gonna help the number, but I'm giving this one because it's called the hot honey bacon and I got traces of hot honey. I have to give it like a 44. I'm giving it a 44. I'm happy with that number. It would have been in the 30s probably if it didn't have such a really good uh, brioche bun. But um, there you go, another review in the books. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, please do not forget to check me out on Instagram and Twitter. That is social media, getting the word on my channel out to the masses. I did a little quick one because the guy that parked next to me right here is now sitting back in his uh, truck with the door open, either eating or drinking whatever he got. So he's literally like a foot from me. Oh, now he just shut the door. That was wild. That was so strange. I don't think you can fully grasp the things you see uh, while you're filming these videos in the car. People out in the wild, um, it's like, I don't know. I can't explain it. There he goes right there. I'll let him go by. All right. All right, thank you so much. I appreciate each and every one of you. Check out, uh, don't check out, light up the comment section below. Let me know if you've tried this sandwich. Let me know your thoughts on how it looks and sounded. I was really excited when I heard Mike's Hot Honey uh, collabing with Duncan, but that right there, no.